We're talking trains, planes, automobiles, and bicycles, specifically e-bikes. We're at uh, Crazy Lenny's e-bikes here on Odana Road on the west side of Madison. And later on, he's going to tell us how to get an amazing deal on a 2019 and 2020. Yes, 2020, the Yikes. new models that will be coming out. So stick around for that. Right now, though, if you've ever wanted to uh, man a Viper jet or <laughs> drive a dune buggy or maybe uh, a cool McLaren race car, this is the man that's going to help you do it in miniature. Joining us right now is Michael Sagel of uh, Tracks Hobbies in RC Raceway. Long name. <laughs> Thanks for joining us today, uh, Michael. 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 All right, so um, before we get started talking about what you've brought in today, mm -hmm. tell our viewers what you have in store. Yeah, so Tracks Hobbies is a retail hobby store um, that specializes in remote control models, and we feature drones and airplanes and trains and boats and lots and lots of vehicles. And lots and lots of fun. And lots right? and lots of fun. For all ages. <laughs> <laughs> and you have a lot of new and exciting things coming up. So can you give us a little Absolutely. preview of all that? Yeah, we're really awesome. excited about a lot of new things that we've got at Trucks Hobbies right now. We have our indoor circuit going very well where we feature a modern day slot car track and an indoor remote control car track for small model cars. But we're really excited about our latest venture, which is our outdoor off road, dirt, remote control car track. And that's wow. at your location? It's at our location. Now this is kind of a big deal because no one else has one for, what, an like hour? Like basically an hour drive around Madison, wow. um, distant from Madison. Yeah, Milwaukee has a few tracks and so forth, but it's been a few years since Madison has had a track like this, so we're mm -hmm. really, really excited to offer something, a family-oriented environment for the public to enjoy. Congratulations mm -hmm. on getting that. That's really cool. Yeah, you definitely. You have to drive all the way to Milwaukee to have fun with some of these <laughs> right? things right here. Yeah. Okay, so if people are interested in this outdoor track, mm -hmm. um, what do they have to have? What kind of equipment? Uh, absolutely. A lot of people call us and ask us, what can I do to get started? My kids really want to jump into that. So it's actually really simple. Um, many of the model of the remote control cars that we feature in the store come ready to run, which means they come with a vehicle with its transmitter. And then the only other thing that you need besides the vehicle and the transmitter is a rechargeable battery and a charger to charge that battery. Um, the vehicles that we feature are electric, uh, no nitro or gas powered vehicles allowed in our outdoor track. but. Um, but it, the equipment is fairly simple. And ready to go out of the box, no assembly required. Correct. We also have, for those who want to maybe work in the family and build a project, we have lots of project cars where you can build uh, and, and customize the entire vehicle. But most of our vehicles nowadays come ready to run out of the box, and then we have hundreds if not thousands of option parts and upgrade parts that you can put on the vehicles to make them perform uh, better or more rugged and so forth. You need a pit crew for those. Yeah, <laughs> or you can be your own pit crew, which is right? uh, the fun. Oh the my learning. gosh, so quite a variety <laughs> that can and cannot like run on the outdoor track. Right? Yes, yes, okay. we, we have such a variety of vehicles. We have over a dozen brands. We have over 30 cars out of the box on display at tracks. It can wow. be a little daunting when you come in and see all these small cars and these large cars that run on gasoline and everything. Where, what can I use and right. where do I get started? This, the cars that we feature on outdoor track are the most popular cars in the world, and that is they are all one-tenth scale, which means lined up end to end, they are one-tenth the size of the real vehicle that they're modeled after. Oh, okay. even the dune buggy. Oh, even the dune buggy is modeled oh. after a real dune buggy. So they, we will allow out on the track uh, dune buggies. Um, this is an open wheel type of uh, two wheel drive vehicle. This is a monster truck, um, <laughs> very similar to the buggy in that it's open wheel but has a high center of gravity and a large ground clearance. You said this one can like pop wheelies. It'll pop wheelies all the time. This one, <laughs> oh. yeah, a little bit. Challenging. Even you can pop wheelies. <laughs> <laughs> absolutely, uh, absolutely. And then this one is a, an actual four wheel drive. This is a short course racing truck. You can actually see these drive full scale at Road America uh, and tracks around the, the, the state and the country. We've seen some of your videos <laughs> right. and they are pretty fun to see. When is the track available? How much does it cost? How late in the season? Yes, so important thing is the track will always be seasonal. So as soon as the snow hits, the track is closed. Okay. <laughs> um, just for safety and, and so forth. Um, but uh, the track will be open when generally the store is open. Um, and uh, the cost to use the track is $10 per driver per day. They can come and go. Um, we do have a pit 
uh, area on site. Um, we have a, a covered driver stand out on the track. Um, so if there's you know some maybe downpours, it's okay. That actually helps the track uh, settle all the dust because yeah. it is a dirt track. All right, Michael, uh, I'm afraid oh, we're gonna yes. have to go. There's yes. so much to talk oh about. Oh my gosh, you you're can very check interesting. check them out online to get more information. That sounds great. We'll Absolutely. be right back with more Wisconsin Women.